up guys, Mom Vernon Kid here, back again, how's everybody doing? And welcome back to the Opinion Spot, uh, and today, guys, um, I wanted to give my thoughts and my, I wanted to give my opinion on the first image and the, the look, the first image and look, the first image and look, the first image and look of David Harbour as Hellboy in the, the Hellboy reboot, um, that's coming out soon. Uh, as you all know, David Harbour, you know, he stars in Stranger Things, can't wait, come this October. Um, and when he was casted as Hellboy, you know, I was a little bit like, okay, hmm. I've seen a little bit of his work, of course, before, prior to him in Stranger Things, you know, he, he was in Equalizer and things like that, but, uh, you know, I was just like, okay, you know, I wish it was Ron Perlman, but all right, I'm gonna give it a shot. And when I saw this image, I was like, damn. Is that him in? Because I'm like, dude got in a great shape for that role, if that's the case. Um, and I was trying to look up more images, like, okay, did he get in a good, great shape? Did he put on muscle for this? Or is this a lot of prosthetics? And to find out, I read it in Men's, Men's Health um, that he did. He got in a really good shape to transform himself into this iconic character and when I saw the image at first I thought it was fake I'm like oh, this is not this is that's Ron Perlman you know just a uh, maybe an unused image but I'm looking I'm like no it don't look too much like Ron but I'm like damn he got in a great shape the you can see if you look at the image and you probably seen the image to my to my uh to my uh to my left, your right. Um, he pretty much looks like he got the red hair. He got the great shape. You can see the muscle definition in him, and he's got the stone arm. In the, don't that's the only thing about the stone arm. And this is just still, but it, it does look a little bit like metal. But uh, who knows? Um, but he looks like he got in a great shape, y'all. I'm I was my jaw dropped when I saw Mr. Harbor. I'm like. I'm like, damn, I love seeing stuff like this. I love seeing when actors really get into the characters and they're like, okay, you know what? I'm gonna hit the gym. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna bulk up if I, it needs me to bulk up. That's why I respect guys like Chris Evans. Where he bulks up for Cap. I'm like, dude does that. Ryan Reynolds and, and, and uh, Henry Cavill, you know, how they bulked up for their roles. Hugh Jackman, come on. I love that, and I love it, and I respect that. So, a huge respect goes to Mr. Harbour for that. Uh, thank you, and after, I, after reading that in Men's Health. Um, he looked, I'm definitely going to check this out. I enjoyed the first two Hellboy movies. I'm not going to sit here and lie to you guys. Back in, when the first Hellboy movie came out, I didn't read too much Hellboy back in the day. But, you know, I've, I read enough to understand who the character was. And and uh, Mr. Harbor just looks really good uh, as the role. Now he's not he's he's also going to be joined by uh, Mila Djokovic, who's going to play the main villain. And uh, we're we're going to get um, uh, Daniel Day Kim as uh, another character who was meant to be played. They they really want to they were going to go with uh, Ed uh, Skern Skin Skin Skern. I'm, who played, you know, in Deadpool? I'm getting, I'm butchering his name. I apologize, but he dropped out because the whole he was going to play a character who was really Asian American, Asian descent, and he dropped out. And I respect him for doing it too. I was like, yeah, you make it. That's a point that Hollywood needs to learn: is stop whitewashing characters. And Daniel Day Kim comes on to take the role. And he gave a lot of props and respects to Mr. Uh, Stern. I hope I'm saying his name right once again. For, you know, for graciously bowing out and make, making a stand, you know. I like that. Maybe this is a trend that hopefully we see more of. But in terms of Mr. Harbor here, he looks badass. He looks just... Mm. My opinion... He gets a 10. Just a look alone, he looks a 10. Of course, yeah, we need to see him in motion. But as of right now, this still 
spot on. Great. Ron Perlman should be proud. I hope Mr. Perlman, Perlman saw this and was like, he looks good. He looks good. After my own heart. But other than that, guys, this is my Vernon Kid saying peace, one love. Stay tuned. Keep it real. Yum the Geek High Lord of New York. Bid you farewell, adieu, as always. Tell me, guys, in the comment section below, what do you think? Do you like the look? How do you feel about Mr. Harbor? Do you think he looks good? And other than that, it's the opinion spot where your opinion matters. I'm out.